G'day guys, Scotty here from The Hook and The Cook and welcome back to our channel. I'm off to Sydney's International Boat Show today in Darling Harbour. Uh, it's Australia's biggest boat show and it's on every August here in Sydney. And uh, I'm catching up with Gary Brown, I'm up at Sutherland at the moment. We're going to uh, catch a train in as the uh, traffic in Sydney is atrocious and we find the uh, train's the best form of transport to get there. Um, we're going to cruise around and check a few things out, say hello to a few people, should be a good day. Now guys, if you haven't tuned into The Hook and The Cook before, Click the link below to join in the fun weekly as we post new clips every Friday. So let's go and check out the boat show. Oh, this looks like it's my train. The train on platform one goes to Rondo Junction, Wallai Creek. First stop, Janali, then Mortdale, Penshurst, Firstville, Wallai Creek, Sydenham, Redburn, Central, Yeah, good. <laughs> should be a good day. It should be, yeah. yeah. Lots of boats to see. You went out there yesterday? Yeah, I went out yesterday, yeah. Had a look around? Yeah, yeah I um, had a look at um, inside mainly, but not outside actually. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Bay, yeah. Oh, you and I are going to explore today? Yes. Sounds good. Well, I've just arrived in Darling Harbour, guys. We're down here at Cockle Bay, and uh, down below me there is all the boats set up in uh, Cockle Bay. These are the bigger boats that are on display at the International Boat Show down here in Sydney. It's a gorgeous day in Darling Harbour and all the smaller exhibitors are set up over the back there uh, in the uh, convention centre. So I've just got to catch up with Gary, he's ahead of me and uh, we'll go and uh, go inside first probably and have a look around and then we might come out later and check out some of the uh, unaffordable boats, well for us anyway. All right, Gary, one of the most important stands here at the boat show, the Hunts Marine stand. Well, good mate, Johnny Hunt. Got a lovely display this year. Plenty of boats for people to look at. Some of these new Quinnies are pretty, pretty smart, aren't they, with this oh, yeah. new design? Yeah. And might hopefully we'll trade, uh, might need to trade mine in. And trade your boat in. Yeah. yeah. So hopefully we we'll get a chance to chat to Johnny later. And uh, yeah, he's got a nice stand here at the show. Right in the middle of level one in the convention centre. Okay, just entering level two now, upstairs of the boat show. And up here we have mainly a lot of electronics, outboards, a few boat companies on display. Right around to the Lorance stand and Simrad. We've got some, uh, a nice setup over here. Uh, wander in and have a chat to someone and see if I can uh, get some info on a new sounder. All right, we're just up on the second level, coming over to an interesting design at the moment. These are a new boat on the market. How you going? How are you? Yeah, Scotty Lyons, how you doing? Craig Jones. Craig, how you going? Tell us a bit about your boat. Well, these are the microcat range of boats. Yep. Um, we started this process back about 2010. Yep. And we've been developing the boat ever since. Okay. This boat is unique in the world, and it's got nothing. Um, it's, it's, it's nothing similar to any other product out there. This boat will travel in 300 mil of water, full speed. This boat 
be able to drive straight up on the beach and put your ramps down. You can drive your bikes on or off it, or you can um, set up your tent on the front of the boat. Yeah, I've seen some really good footage that Gary Brown did for you. Um, and uh, out on a boat test, yep. and he did an article and stuff, so yeah, quite impressive. That was coming through the uh, wrong side of the bar at Swansea, which I wouldn't allow the viewers to do, but uh, <laughs> this boat will go through the, the bar at Swansea uh, without hands if you want, it'll just track perfectly and never broach. Excellent. All right, well, thanks Thanks for that little bit of a chat. Nice to meet you. Thank you, too. No worries at all. Cheers. Bye. We'll see you soon. Okay, we're just heading down now to the Berkeley fishing stand. And uh, Paul Burt is on stage at the moment, promoting for Shimano. Sunday. So, we're going to start to bring up our boys now as we head into this. So, please, gentlemen. So, this is the, uh, the top 15 in the Brim series at the boat show. They're fishing Sydney Harbour tournament over the next three days. Okay, we're just coming up onto the stress-free winches now, stainless steel drum winch. And this is the winch that I run on my boat. And these guys have been around for about 20 years, making these winches. How you go? Howdy, how are you? Yeah, good. And uh, I've run mine now on my boat, on the green machine, for about eight years and had very little problems with it. It's been a fantastic unit. So guys, if you're looking for a good winch, can't go past the stress-free. Just heading around to the Yamaha stand now. They've got a fantastic range of brand new motors out here at the show. Yamaha fan I am. Had one on the green machine for quite a while. Okay, just down on the uh, Hunts Marine stand, Gary's just checking out a boat, thinking that he'd like to buy. Yeah, this one here from Hunts Marine. It's not a what do you reckon? Boat, is this is Gary's boys. You like it? Hey? His, his grandkids, That's Lockie Riley. and Riley. And what's in there? Can we get it up? Keep pulling. Pull keep nice going. and hard. Oh, there you go, what have we got in there? There we go, Lift he's just up. showing the hatch and there's another hatch. Lift it up, push up, up you come. Up okay, you battery, go. battery box in there. So the battery goes in there. Yep. Yeah. So not, not a pretty impressive boat, this one, Gary. Yeah, it's a nice boat. Yeah, different Five design minutes. from Quintrex. All right, I'm going to leave you guys alone. I'm going to go and look at some more boats. Okay. All right, catch you a bit later, Gary. Well guys, Gary and I have had a really good look around the show today. We've seen a, a lot of uh, exhibitors, had a look at a lot of different products. <laughs> had a good day so far, Gary? Yeah, mate, it's been really good. Yeah. It's really good. Well, uh, we're going to head outside now and check out the, uh, the Hobie stand and what's going on out here. And then maybe uh, duck down and have a look at some of the bigger boats uh, they've got in the marina down at Copper Bay. This is the uh, the outdoor pond, the Hobie outdoor pond outside. This is on the uh, the top level, level four. We've got this set up for the kids to play around in the Hobies and for people to try the Hobies out. We've got plenty of other boats up here as well on the outside roof area. Some of the uh, high speed ocean racing boats. Okay, we've left the uh, convention centre. We're down now on the uh, Cockle Bay area, checking out some of the larger boats. This is uh, Millionaire Road down here, or or some. They've definitely got some serious boats down here. I couldn't see you fishing for brim out of any of them, Gary. Oh, I don't know. I reckon I could make a point of doing this one. A bit of pocket change, 99,000. Yeah, get up on the front there and cast off the deck. I don't know if the Minn Kota will reach the water. No, nah, I don't think it would. 
Well, guys, Gary and I have had a fantastic day at the Sydney International Boat Show. Plenty of stuff to look at and uh, definitely worth coming down next year if you're in Sydney. Now, guys, tune in next week to another fantastic clip on the Hook and the Cook. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, click the link below, and uh, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And we'll see you guys on the water next week. Cheers.